so I've just done the video on showing you how to design these cutouts using the um, craft robot or the silhouette on the silhouette studio software and I've got all these now cut out so I'm ready to assemble the card and from here on in it should be really quick because everything's you know here and ready to go so let's get started I've got my base card and I'm going to do it portrait and the fold is going to be at the top um, it's just a standard size card first of all I want to stick this one down so I'm just going to idea this one straight down to the base card okay um, next I need to stick this one down um, I'm going to raise this one off using three-dimensional stickers so I'm just going to stick a load of those around the edge and then a couple in the middle just to give it some support mm, actually I've gotten a little ahead of myself first of all before I stick this one down I need to um, adhere these star shapes so I'm just going to line them up where I want them and I'm just going to stick these straight down to the base card I'm just going to use some normal PVA glue for that um, this Tombow glue dries really really quickly so it's great for projects like this okay next I'm going to stick the smaller shinier stars and I'm going to use some three dimensional stickers for these I'm just going to adhere those down to these brown stars, just centralising them on there so they're framed by around the outside by that um, brown star we just stuck down. Okay, and then we can stick this down. I'm going to make it slightly off centre towards the bottom. I'm going to line it right up with that side, on this right hand side and just stick it down so it slightly covers those stars just to kind of bring the card together and then all we need to do is adhere these letters down I'm just going to set them out on here first so I know I have enough room to spell what I need to spell go ahead and start sticking them down. Again I'm using my Tombow glue for this. Mainly because it dries really really quickly and once they're stuck down they don't come back up. Someone advised me to purchase a Xyron machine for this. Um, it would make it a lot quicker and easier. And I do believe they're right. I just haven't got around to buying myself one yet. But when I do, I shall show you how I go with it. Okay, and just to finish up, what I'm going to do is just do some faux stitching around that um, curved edge here. And then just as one last thing, I'm just going to corner around these bottom two corners using the half inch setting on my We Are Memory Keepers corner chomper. And that's the card for today. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.